it's just you walk into any place and it, like the calzones are always there. <laughs> like, they're not they're not flying off the shelf like, yeah yeah that's totally true like you'll have the display for the pizza where like the pizza's spinning and it's staying nice and warm and the calzone's like let me go to the freezer in the back for a second yeah, i'll yeah, be right yeah, yeah. One second 100 percent. and like you know people are like ordering slices of the pizza you know they're, 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 they're taking it off the pie but like the cheese on the calzone has like set in it's clearly been there for it's wrapped in saran wrap <laughs> So I'm with that, you know, like tr- trashy, kind of trashy. That's like that. Uh, oh shit, I don't want to get Luke crazy. Isn't happy. Uh, that Luke, that's like that um, Lewis Black bit where he's shitting on candy corn. He's like, all the candy corn in the world was made in 1943, and every year <laughs> they go around to the trash cans around the country and then they recollect them. And he's like, they wash it, they wash it, and then they'll repackage <laughs> it and sell it back to you. <laughs> That is classic 2008 yeah. Black, or whatever that was. Yeah. It's also true, though. Like, it's so I'm true. I'm immediately suspicious of people who like candy corn. Like, yeah. really? You do? Well, my wife does. I'm always suspicious of her, though. Oh, I don't know. I don't Fuck know. That. I haven't met your wife before, but I'm, 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 I don't know. I'm not you feeling sh- it. You shouldn't be. <laughs> you shouldn't be. She's wrong. <laughs> She's fucking wrong. It's like when people say they don't like bacon or something like that. It's like, are you a person... I know, I know a number of people that like candy corn, though, and it is, it's like, what, who, who tortured your taste buds into liking that? (laughs) Who did that to you? They must love saran wrapped cold calzones too. That must be like that's that's a different, (laughs) the whole kind of area of people. Luke takes offense to your, your, your calzone hate. (laughs) You, I, all right. To be fair, to you know, to to play kind of the both sides here. A freshly made, well, like made calzone, is good. You just said an oxymoron. That is that is an oxymoronic well, statement. What did I say? I, I know I worded it terribly. But There's like, no such is... thing as a as a freshly made, <laughs> well made calzone. <laughs> they just don't exist. I I have there's a place near me called Twisted Pizza. <laughs> they have a decent calzone, but I'll always get the pizza first. Yeah, as you should. Yeah, of course. Because you're not insane. (laughs) You don't hate yourself. (laughs) Why would you do that? I'm so depressed today, I just need to have a calzone. Yeah, dude. Yeah, that just reeks of, again, talking about comedians' bits about food. Uh, There's a really good Pat Oswalt bit about the famous bowl at KFC. It's so. Oh. <laughs> it's such a good. Does he say bad? Bit. Does he say bad things about the famous bowl? Yes, yes. He goes. He, <gasps> he he's like, hey, so uh, I'm at the Kentucky Fried Chicken. What do you What do you uh, as as someone who works here suggest? Oh, well, obviously you've got to try the chicken. You know, the breading. It has a bunch of spices in it that are great. It's just, oh, it's so good. You definitely got to get that. And uh, oh, the mashed potatoes. The mashed potatoes and the gravy. The gravy's so tangy and tasty. Mmm. And the corn, the corn is so sweet and juicy and it has a nice crunch. And then flip back to the other guy. Okay, hold on, stop. Can you just take all of that shit and put it in a bowl for me? He's like, no, <laughs> well, I could like serve them separately on a plate with a fork and knife like you're a human with dignity. Nope, <laughs> fuck it. Put it in a bowl. Put it in a bowl. I want that all in one bowl. <laughs> and then he goes, America has spoken. Pile my food in a fucking pile. I don't give a shit anymore. I, I walked away for a sec. Are you talking about the KFC famous bowl? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yes. I thought so. Well, yes. you know what? I've only had it like one time, and I agree with Luke here. I thought it was kind of good. Uh, just because, like, yeah. <laughs> it's got like, like people like layers in food. I feel like you know, mm-hmm. like the six layer nacho dip get from costco or whatever like that's that, that's a good time same thing with the famous bowl like did i feel shame did i feel shame <laughs> yeah, yes as you should yes it's just a pile of food would i eat it again oh, I, yes. I have no fast food shame i even had the double down from kfc the famous bowl oh my god nothing compared to the shame of eating a double down he also has a bit about the double down he's like i think they heard my bit and we're like oh yeah comedian guy you want to you want to make a joke make a joke about this <laughs> The double down is literally it like is. the patties are chicken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's basically a cheese and bacon sandwich where the bread is chicken. <laughs> That's basically <laughs> what it is. 
So it's two patties of chicken with bacon and cheese in between. Even if you want to get even more specific, it's basically like having a double chicken sandwich with no bread. It's really that. Like if you put two pieces of bread on either side, it would just be like like a double bacon cheeseburger or something like that, but with chicken instead. And they just took the bread off and were like, "Hey, let's just sell it." There's bread on the chicken. It's breaded chicken. It's good enough. Just sell yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 